Hey, what's good, guys? How you doing? I'm doing all right so far. Just trying to stay warm as possible because I still can't believe it got really cold all of a sudden from late to crack of dawn. But I get it. It's the time of the month. It just sucks, though, because myself and cold weather just don't get along because I easily get freezing to my you know what. And yet it's going to be like that throughout the fall to winter. And I got, I got it prepared. So this is, this is going to be a real pain in the ass. But I, I still I got to survive, though. But at least the good news is I'm not working tomorrow. So I at least can just relax and unwind. And more importantly, that I'm already have plans for later tonight. And um, can't wait to see. But for right now, let's get on with some more grinding because um, I'm pretty sure that some of you are already aware of what's going on. But for those who haven't, uh, I'm pretty sure that you know this from treat posts to Facebook posts that there's going to be a new trailer for the upcoming movie, The Batman, and which that was from yesterday. So it's already out now. And um, yeah, <laughs> Um Last time I reacted the the teaser trailer, and I, even though that I was amazed of what I'm seeing so far, it's just that uh, I wasn't paying attention to the uh, few little things that was pretty obvious that that the uh, the main villain for this upcoming movie is none other than the Riddler from of uh, the subliminal messages, uh, like the letters and quote unquote to the Batman. It was. It was pretty obvious that, that it is the Riddler. And if that's not, not enough, then there are a couple of uh, question marks that has already been shown. So, yeah, um, my bad on that one. So, um, be more attention to everything because uh, you never know exactly uh, what's going to be the, the details of, uh, of a certain characters. But uh, I learned my lesson. But... Here it is now, so let's go ahead and take a look at this, and without further ado, it's time to react. That was the Riddler at Enigma. Fear is a tool. Awesome. When that light hits the sky, it's not just a call. It's a warning. To all the criminals. Oh, okay. Ooh, hoo, hoo. shit. Selena. Woo. If this continues, it won't be long before you've nothing left. I don't care what happens to me. It's only gonna get worse for you. Whoa, take it easy, sweetheart. That you obviously that's the penguin. Maybe we're not so different. Who are you under there? Oh my god. Is that really that necessary? I mean Ah, oh, there's the Batmobile. What's black and blue and dead all over? Are you sure about that? Yeah. I think it's the other way around. Okay. That part is pretty cool with the music at the end. March 4th.
That's next year. Damn. Um, this is pretty cool. I think that, that this, excuse me, this trailer is way better than the teaser. So, now it's, I think I already made it clear, so I don't think it's no sense for me, for me to bring it up. But, um, now the question remains is that, what did Edward Nigma do? I mean, I think he must have did something really big at that he got arrested. And I don't know, but uh, anyone who's that, you know, in, incredibly smart, that would, would snap. And let me at least say that, that um, this, this, this may be the, the, the big time that uh, the Riddler deserves to, to, to be treated to be in, in the spotlight to this film. And that, uh, that you know, to be more serious of it in that um that last movie that that um felt un uh, unappealing which I'll talk about uh Batman Forever and don't get me wrong I got nothing against with Jim Carrey it's just that um it's just that he's just being Jim Carrey and not you know being as Nigma if you know what I'm saying but um the way that this, this is getting a little, little deep, and but the but the riddles are still the same. It's just giving that the vibe of um, Jigsaw from Saw. That's probably what I'm seeing in in that way of it. And of course, that Robert Pattinson as Bruce Wayne is still, you know, it's still kind of little different than. What we are such accustomed to from Twilight to Tenant, but uh, I think that he may he may nailed it, and given the fact that that the that the bullets don't harm him, and that the the armor it looks like it's a very light weighted, and that's going to be very hard to try to kill a man who dressed up in, as a bat, and that 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 one part that that just. Just grab him to the to the of the of the left pole, and I think I could be wrong to say this, but I think there was a there's a little shocking at the back of there. I was like, whoa, he, he is not to be messing around. But that is a pretty pretty cool slick looking of a Batmobile, so it's not as big you know, or hulky looking as it, but it's still slick. So I guess it is just given some of the, of the previous from the comics that was like back in the. Uh, Somewhere between like the between the eighties and the nineties, so it's still pretty good looking, and obviously that that's got to be Oswald Cobblepot, by, pl played by Colin Farrell, and uh, the, I can't even. T I mean, it, I did instantly just hear his voice. It's just that I, I'm still questioning: did, did he really gain a few pounds, or is that just a fat suit that he's wearing? Because um. Still, it's it's pretty good looking at that. It's just hard to tell. And Catwoman, oh my goodness, that was the new look. From I think that's gotta be like a, a, a that's gotta be a, a wig piece of that that she was wearing as, as a disguise. But that is that 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 her hair is short, just like it is in the comics. So there's that. So I will say that that I will give a shot with this. Just to see where, how this all from the point A to point B. And maybe, and I'm just saying that as maybe, maybe this movie is going to be good. Personally, I do like Ben Affleck as Batman. And I did hear rumors that, that there's going to be a live series that's going to be exclusive to HBO Max. That's, at least that's what I heard. But you could just, you could at least tell me differently and that, that's fine. But either way, um... I'm going to give a shot with this. So, so when it comes to, um, oh, excuse me, when it comes out in March, uh, I will give, give it a chance to see if it's going to be good or if it's going to be a meh. So we're just going to see, but I'm liking it so far. It actually has some, a lot in depth with this. And I am aware that this is going to be, it's going to be treated to as a, another parallel earth, or that's what we call it as the alternate Earth. But 
I think that's going to be it for right now. So if you guys do enjoy this, and if this is the movie that you want to see, and for all the Batman fans out there, then leave a likes and also leave a comment down below, and I will catch y'all in the next video. So take care, guys, and be safe.